Hello and welcome back to the next episode of Sun Gamer Plays Deus Ex Human Revolution. We are in the liberty of mind and body. Something international. This is a villain. They're just afraid of what they don't understand. That leads to self-protection, and defense always evolves into offense. Always. Mm. Civilian, you have interesting things to say. I saw I could go into here earlier. Uh, let's have a look into here. Is it true they stop your heart and the machine does your breathing? More or less. Oh, that sounds terrifying. a little hair raising, but we do it every day, several times over. It's a very safe procedure. Will I feel any pain or anything? It gets done through your IV needle. You'll be asked to count backwards, and the next thing you know, you'll be opening your eyes and the procedure will be over. Wow. Will I dream? Not while you're under, but you might afterward as you wake up. Okay, that guy would be me every time I've, if I ever have to go into a surgery. Except that I won't then stand still. I'll also be just going to... And like crouching up and down. Going... How wow. you doing, buddy? Uh, sorry, I was just looking at that scar on your head. What scar? Let me look at myself. Ooh, yeah, that's a big scar. What about you? If you're here for some work, please go to the counters. Okay, what about you? Ooh. Let's get into the bottom. Uh, Miss Magulus. Of course I appreciate Mr. Saraf's support. Which is why I will do my best to explain to my patient exactly what this generous gift entails. But that is as far as I will go. From now on, who whatever augmentations he decides to acquire will be his choice. And his alone. The patient, and not the employer, will be the one to decide whether a half-tested prototype augmentation should be included with all the others or not. Sincerely, Vera Markovic, MD, Lim International, Detroit Branch. I believe you have misconstrued Mr. Saraf's intent, Vera. He only wanted to give your patient some general medical advice. Athena Margulis. Hmm. I like you, Athena. Don't make me change that. Attention all staff! An inspection team from the World Health Organization will be paying a visit to your limb clinic within the next week or so, in order to evaluate conditions there. Please ensure that everything is properly prepared for their inspection. When they arrive, treat them with courtesy. But continue your business and do not interfere. In anticipation of the visit, all employees must ensure that WHO guidelines are being followed to the letter at all times. Bear in mind that any negative evaluation will surely infringe upon your clinic's ability to solicit funding. Thank you for your understanding. Karim Fong, MD. Blood O R H D negative. Is that universal recipient I, or donor? Can't remember which. Unknown. Adopted at five. No papers. Oop, hang on. Has demonstrated healing ability greater than two standard deviations above the mean in the following: speed of recovery, repossession of facilities, post-traumatic memory retention, unusually large quantities of NGF appearing around implantation sites. A uh, unique autoimmune disorder may in may indicate that he will not require neuropathine injections anytime soon. One previous operation, six months ago, life critical, requiring full replacement of chest cavity and left arm, right arm, and legs at behest of employer. Wait, the legs weren't required to be replaced, but he did it anyway? Authority granted under terms of employment contract. Recovery speed being unknown at the time, patient was also prefitted with pedo bio... pedot? pedo? biochips in all areas of possible neuropathy neuroprosthetic insertion to reduce the physiotherapy following any subsequent enhancement of surgeries. Hmm. So he set it up so that I can then also be infected more later, I guess? Huh. Interesting. Ooh, e-book. About the eye. Pause if you'd like to read. Can I watch his surgery? No? Okay. Alright, I think we're done the limb clinic. In a few years, we'll all wonder how we got along before. I know him. that, officer. But some of those guys were carrying tire irons and setting Ooh. garbage cans on fire. And They're those hobos. Those are the ones we arrested. The rest were merely exercising their right to free speech. I can't believe I'm with the cop. To come to work each day without fearing for my life. Deal with it. I've still got to walk home tonight. I understand your concern. But if you want round the clock protection, I suggest you hire a private security. I'm sorry, excuse me. <coughs> sorry, I just, uh, that was, yeah. I mean, I've had bell towers good, buddy. If you wanna go and wanna go with them. Prepare for lag as loading occurs. 
Yep, there we go. Down to... Oh, we went to below 15 video FPS for a second. Adam, are you finished at the clinic? Yeah, just this second. Good. Right now I want to know who that corpse is. Head over to the police station and get his neural hub. And Adam, if you can't talk your way in, consider making a strategic retreat. There's got to be another entrance in the side of the building. Ooh. A new newspaper. All right. Uh, tragedy was averted at Milwaukee Junction this evening. Detroit SWAT team swept through the Sarif Industries match. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that would be because, um, I got rid of them all. <laughs> uh, let me stand off. I think we may have actually read this already, but if we haven't, there you go. Oh, nope, hang on. Yep, there we go. What's over here? Okay, I want to go into here, but I'm not entirely sure that it's safe to do so, so I'm going to save. Because you can't really engage with the police in this game. Let's go here. Alright, let's do this. And done. And no one saw? Excellent. What's in here? Some beer. Okay, what do I need to drop to pick up some... Yeah, I don't need a grenade. Are you a person? No, you're just a sleeping bag. Is this literally just a hobo's... Hang on. Nope. Is there literally nothing in here but that beer? And a radio thing. Hmm. Odd. Okay. That's really odd. There you go. Alright, so um, there was some beer in there and that was all. Totally worth it. Don't want to go in there. What's over here, though? I mean it, man. Get lost. All right then. You hadn't actually said it yet, so um. Take a hike. Who do you think you are? I think I'm Adam Jensen. What about you guys? Are you guys gonna be rude too? Nice night for a walk. But you might want to stay on a derelict road. Good to know. Thank you. Okay, there's not anything up for me this way, is there? But you're open! Let me in! Is there anyone in there? Ooh, it's a ghost shop. Ooh. Hey, Saraf. It's not a great ad, Saraf. Alright, where am I going? Oh, hey, a gas station. Is this the one that was being talked about earlier? Uh, trash can, not very interesting. Alright, let's find out. Hello. I ain't got nothing for you. Check with the man. And keep your hands where I can see them. Wait, what? Hang on. No better. The myth of human augmentation. I'm just gonna have a quick poke around. Man, this 7 Eleven has uh, seriously gone downhill. You got anything you wanna buy or sell? I'm the guy you wanna deal with. Everything's on the computer, right at your fingertips. Okay. Uh, sell. I wanna sell a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, the first thing I want to sell uh, is my ammo for... No, never mind. I want to sell this. Double barrel shotgun. 750. Nice. And 1750. Nice. Anything I want to buy? Uh, damage upgrades? Uh, I think I have a handgun rifle or firearm. Yeah, alright. Burst round system. For shotgun. Well, I don't use the shotgun. Okay. A weapon? No, not really my thing. Mind template? Eh. Yeah. I think we're good for the moment. Pleasure. Thank you. Anything of interest elsewhere? Nope. Okay. Well, at least we're finally able to get. We finally got a little bit more inventory space now that I'm not holding onto stuff that I need to sell later. Because it's now been later. I've sold it. Yay! Excitement. 
Also parkour. Yeah, Jensen. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I failed. No offense, but I wouldn't get enhancements even if I could afford them. I don't take any offense, as long as you didn't mean any. Real tight merch. Those art lovers get in my face now. I'm ready to pop. Grace, where he at? Yo, where you been, man? You've been running shit through that abandoned gas station for weeks. Right there. I wanted to get some upgrades from my Zenith 10 mil. He can hook you up nice, man. If you go, tell him I sent you. I want a discount next time. Word. Seems fair. What do you say? What you need, player? Cause I know where you can cop some goods. If you want some. Yo, you look like the man who knows where to find that good shit. Upgrades, weapons, stuff like that. Oh, I feel like, uh... I've got to find, like, something to pick up. Though, uh, like, a. Uh... I'm thinking about getting my pit bull augmented. Get him some you know, cyber paws and cyber fangs and shit. You know, throw him in the ring. The augmentation? Yeah, it works. <laughs> we should... Uh, what do you call that? Register. Patent. Trademark? Copyright. Yeah, copyright. Uh, no, trademark. That'd be a trademark. Yo, we're gonna be rich, man. Yeah, you're gonna be very dumb. Alright, uh, I want some boxes, though. This city is uh, I found some box. I found a box. Sorry, I just heard that guy whistling that, and I thought, that's a great thing to whistle. I've got to feel some time as I just waddle back over to... Ooh, there's a door there. Waddle back over to here. Let's jump, Jensen. Excuse me, I need some more boxes. Yeah, that does increase my height. Alright, good. Up there now, yeah. Oh, hang on, up. Oh, never mind. Hold on. Mm, yeah, let's try that again. And then up, and then yeah, hold on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. I need more boxes. I want more boxes. I'm going to explore this damn area. If it's the last damn thing I do, there's some stuff there. Ah, oh, if I could pick that up. Too heavy. What's back here? Is there something back here? There is nothing back here. Okay then. Excellent barrels, they can be useful. Line that up so I don't hit anyone. Roar, Jensen, throw. Okay, again, let's line that up so I don't hit anyone. Roar, Jensen, throw. And finally. Rawr, Jensen throw. Ooh, uh, oh, okay, thank goodness. The quick way of moving things is just to draw Jensen throw them. Ooh, that could have gone bad. Fight the power! Wait, wouldn't I want the power not to fight it? I don't understand you, person. Whoever graffitied that. Man, the artist who had the job of graffitiing all this stuff had an interesting job. Alright, let's uh, hop up. Nope, nope. Nope, hang on. Nope. Stay. You staying? Good boy. Let's get another one. Let's put you there. And then you, I'm gonna go here, and then. Nope, hang on, nope, yep, yep. this is difficult. Stay. Good. Also stay. Everything stay. Good things. Nope. 
Nope. Okay. Let's try you. We good? We good. Ah, not quite. Well, let's try this again. Well, damn. Okay. Um. I don't see that working at all. Yep, we're good there. Mm, I, need another, I need another, like, cardboard box or something now. Dang it. Or just another barrel! Yeah! This is a little bit of an elaborate plan. For something that I don't know will be at any help to me. But, I don't know it won't be help. Yes! Explorer bonus and a vent! Woo! It was some help to me. Vent it up. Whoa. Pocket secretary. Okay, the TV crew is on its way. Wait till you can see the green light on the camera before taking the shot. Aim for the area between the cops and the protesters. That way both of them will think the other side fired first. There might be a riot today without your help. Just drop everything and get out there. If that happens, just drop out there and get out there. You'll get paid either way. Oh, they're trying to cause a riot. Okay, well, uh, sniper rifle ammo and a sniper rifle because... Hi, guys. I've got something to sell to you. How may I... I want to sell. I've got this thing that I don't need. It's called a sniper rifle. Uh, where was that sniper ammo? Here. Be sure to tell all your friends. They're just not the cops. Yeah. <laughs> don't worry. I will impersonate your accent terribly and I won't tell the cops. Unless I do. Totally worth however long I spent on it. I might... I know I said yet yeah, last video that two montages in three videos is too many. But I feel like two montages in four videos, totally fine. I might just speed up that footage there of uh, getting my thing. Ooh, what's that? I'm a completionist. Am I Gerard? Detective Chase. Oh, cool. Well, you must be Adam Jensen. That I am. Observation. Mrs. Reed told me you might pay me a visit. And don't take this the wrong way, but you're kind of hard to miss. That I, I am. take that as a compliment. She told me you might have information regarding Megan Reed's case and mm -hmm. the attack on Seraph headquarters. Oh boy, what a mess. Total pissing match. We had the Beta feds under our ass, orders from okay. three different departments, and pressure from so many lobbyists it felt like being the scrawny new kid in the prison shower. Mm, it is a very high-profile case. Mrs. Reed said you thought some procedures were overlooked. You got that right. I mean, you know how it is. Mrs. Reed told me you used to be a cop. Mm -hmm. There's always cases where you see the lazy officers taking shortcuts. But this... this was different. Different how? Too much stuff got overlooked. People seemed way too eager to jump to conclusions, and every time I was remotely insistent, I got turned down by ranking officers. That doesn't People seem wanted good. to bury this thing fast. That's never a good sign. No. Surely you have something more substantial than this. Yeah, well, that's where you come in. I got a couple of leads I could never Ooh, too better. investigate. I started poking around, but these government-type agents just gave me the creeps. I, I got scared. Months away from retirement, I didn't want to fuck things up. But you? You obviously have the means to get to the bottom of this. So what have you got? First off, there's a rumor that the order to close the investigation came mm -hmm. from higher up, maybe even outside mm -hmm. the local department. That's terrible. Anything like Go that on. Pass through Captain Penn. There might be traces of this left on his office computer. Guess I'll have Good to, to pay a visit to the local precinct. Doing that anyway. Oh, well, while you're there, there was an officer assigned to the case, Chet Wagner. He's I not what you dislike call quiet, him already. And when he suddenly got brought on the case, I got suspicious. Somebody wanted him there. And I'm pretty sure he tampered with some of the evidence. And now I dislike him more. You should talk to him. Find out what he knows. Okay. Gotcha. I'll have a little chat with Officer Wagner. You'll most likely find him in the lobby. He got retrograded from his conduct, and he takes depositions now. He won't budge easily, but I'm pretty sure you can find some dirt on him on his desktop. Cool. More hacking. His office is on the third floor. He might find something there to help loosen up his tongue. Anything else worth looking into? Yeah, when the order came down to close the case, the bulk of the evidence was stashed in a storage locker. So he's two Maybe beta and one omega. In there. 
It's on the alley right next to the station. The code is 40... 4891. Thanks. But I know an outside agency had access to that locker, so be careful. Thanks also, thank you. Ah, it's, it's nothing. And, uh, oh, uh, please. True beta, Don't true Omega. coming back here with details. Don't get me wrong, I'm glad to help. But the less I know about this case, the better I'll feel. That's fair. About... Assignment. How did you get assigned to this case? I didn't push for it, if that's what you mean. To be honest, I didn't want to get involved. Why not? Another Omega? I was an honest cop, Jensen. I always tried to conduct myself Whoa. in accordance with the law, Three beta. The procedures, and what I believed was right. Not really the standard MO for a case like this. Shouldn't it be? Alright, uh... Uh, retirement first. Why retire from the force only to become a security guard? I mean, it looks like you still love the work. I love the idea of being a cop. Ever since I was a kid, I wanted Another to Another beta. Force. But I just got fed up. It's not like I had imagined it. It's a job. Some people are good at it, while others just don't care. And it shows. This case, the Seraph case, it was just the last drop in a cup already full. Fair enough. Is that? Oh, so I was keeping track of that for no reason. Excellent. Good now. to know. Ooh, lag for a second. Okay, well, what's over here? Oh, because I know the guy. I just got let straight into the building, do I? Really? That seems so bad. Ooh, cardboard box. Hold on. I said, ooh, cardboard box. Hee <laughs> Have some fire hazards. That fader. Wow, the future has cool fire safeties. Things. Uh, let's see this door. Wait, what's quest one? Oh, hey, it's him. I'll close your door for you. I can never thank you enough for what you did. That's all right. I'm going to loot your place blind, so that's all right. I'm going to rob you guys so bad. Um, I'm going to talk to you Welcome. first. Welcome. I'm glad you came. I can never properly repay you for what you did, of course, but I would like to help out any way I can. I mean, I was just doing my job. What do you have in mind? There's a gentleman named Sarah who works in the area. His business causes him to move around quite a bit. But at the moment, he's occupying an apartment in a building on Earl's Court. Good to know. If you mention my name, he'll give you a discount on his wares. He deals in... Well, he's a gut runner. Ooh. How does a guy like you know someone like that? Growing up in my old neighborhood, you learn pretty quick to cultivate certain types of relationships. That does seem helpful. Good to know. Thank you. Very helpful. I'm going to go snoop around in your bedroom now. Nano augmentation. <laughs> I believe, if I'm not mistaken, oops, if I'm not mistaken, I believe that that is the uh, plot of Deus Ex the original. A security rating. Hack. Hack. Let's see what I can do. Let's go here, and then here. Yes, my stealth thing is kicking in already. Yeah, it doesn't matter. I've kind of gotten you already. And I'll just... Oh, never mind. They got there first. Awesome. Credit chips. Sweet. I mean, now I feel a little bad, but... um, Can I put this back? No? Hmm. Well, it's going to be pretty obvious pretty quick who was there, uh, who did that. I hope I don't get reported for that. Yeah, that would be awkward. Although, you know, kind of justified. Alright, see you guys. You have a lovely bedroom. And a super secure safe. Run, 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 run. Hold on, no. They'll never get past these cardboard boxes. Never! <laughs> Alright, uh, I think we're about to running on time now. So thank you very much for watching Sun Gamer Plays Deus Ex Human Revolution. Uh, leave a like if you liked the video, and please subscribe if you'd like to see more of this series coming straight into your inbox, as well as our Star Wars series. Uh, for those of you who are still not uh, quite sure, we should there should be several episodes of everything up now. Uh, but we run a short and a long uh, game at, at one time, 
So we're currently playing through Star Wars Battlefront 2 and Deus Ex Human Revolution. I mean, this is Deus Ex Human Revolution, so I hope you remember the name of this damn game. Uh, thank you very much for watching. I will see you next in the next video or episode or whenever I see you. Honestly, at the time of recording, I'm not actually sure when this will be uploaded. So thank you very much for watching. See ya.